Will and Josh and I, Josh Gordon and I, um, are, are very close and, and uh, we, you know, we've done a film together and been friends since then and so I think that there wasn't really a big mystery to them about what it is that I do or what I would bring to this and, and I think that they, since they've, they've been with the project for so long, they knew exactly uh, what they'd be getting with me and whether they wanted that or not. So when they asked me to do it, I think they, they figured, you know, he's going to do his thing and, and that is what we want, so let's get him to do that. Well, Jennifer and I have known each other, uh, I don't know, 20 years now? Maybe more? I'm not sure. But we're, uh, we're very close and, you know, just like with anybody in any profession, if you can work with your friends, that's something that you, you'd look to do. And, and um, I hope this is, you know, uh, certainly not the last time that we work together. I think this is five, maybe? Maybe our fifth movie together, something like that. Four or five, maybe six, I don't know. But hopefully there's, there's, hopefully we're only halfway done. TJ is such a great guy. Uh, another good example of somebody who's really, really kind, uh, really good at what he does, uh, really appreciative of, of you know, his, his, his opportunity and, and his access and his relevance. And I mean, he, like, he, he gets it. There's no entitlement there. And so he's just a, really a real fun guy to be around and, and, and uh, a polite guy on the set, which is, which is really important. And um, so we're having a great time and, um, you know, he's making me laugh left and right. And it's, it's you know, we're losing a lot of good takes because I'm, I'm messing up giggling. Um, but um, he's fantastic in this role. Really, really great, unique energy for this, this character. Olivia is, 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 is a real sort of comfortable, easy presence about her and she's got a really good sense of humor, nothing, nothing too precious about what she does or says and she doesn't take anything too seriously and uh, I think, you know, guys, guys are attracted to, uh, you know, a beautiful woman with a great sense of humor and, and um, she's, she's, you know, incredibly talented. I mean, I, you know, you look for something to say that is not perfect. She's 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 got it all. Um, she's a lot of fun to work with. Kate's Kate's such a unique comedic talent. Uh, where I feel like we're really really lucky to have her. Um, I I don't know how sort of you know. Undiscovered, I say that relatively speaking. Um, she's going to be when this movie comes out because you know Ghostbusters. I think will come out beforehand, and and obviously her her presence on Saturday Night Live is is uh, is no secret. But I, I you know, I, she's uh, again relatively you know new and and fresh to audiences, and and she's she's so unique the way that she reads lines and and her her sense of humor it, you know her rhythms is is um it's really really fun it, you know they built will and josh have built a really interesting ensemble and group uh with with this movie and um she's such a great unique flavor to it will and josh have just you know they've been with the project for so long they've had such a clear idea about what what they want to deliver to the audience with this uh it, you know there in the title it, there's there's a promise of an ensemble you you know say office christmas party it's basically all you need to know um there is a christmas party happening in an office which implies a, a big group of people and also since it's an r-rated comedy things things are going to go sideways pretty quick and uh, you hope that there's funny people, you know, driving that, that car off the road. And, and uh, that, that, that literally happens in this movie, <laughs> actually. Um, it's, it's a great group. Well, my character, is, his name is Josh, and, and he's, um, you know, he's not too dissimilar from characters that I've played in the past where, you know, you do, you, you kind, this is kind of a necessary element in, in really in any comedy where you, you have kind of a central, um, 
lens into uh, an absurd world. So, you know, somebody who's kind of us, kind of the the normal guy, the every guy, the the straight man, sort of the the, the protagonist. And that's kind of Josh in this movie. Um, he's uh, he's someone who's trying to keep the office running at a, at a good clip and um, being productive and making sure everything stays uh, stays professional. And, um, you know, if you don't have that element sometimes and kind of then you've got, you know, Martians on Mars and there's nothing really that special about that, you know. It's only weird when they come down to Earth, you know. So I, I'm sort of, you know, the, the steady kind of ball there in the middle. Josh and Tracy and Clay are, um, uh, they are, they are confronted with um, the reality that their, their branch is going to get shut down or, or severely downsized uh, by Jennifer Aniston's character, who happens to be the sister of, of, uh, of TJ. Um, and so in an attempt to, to keep the, the branch open, they, uh, they reach for um, uh, an account um, that that could that could save them. You know, they try to close this uh, this this big account, and in order to attract that that business and 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 court that um, that CEO, uh, this guy Walter Davis, um, they throw a Christmas party and and invite him to it and try to impress him with you know the way in which they they know how to party and and uh, and have fun and. And they uh, they try a little too hard, and 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 things go wrong, and um, you know somebody it would it, it it leaves the office after a little bit, and then we you know we hit the streets of you know Chicago in the middle of the night, and and uh, it, uh, things escalate for sure.